slightly less than a year before the race for the gubernatorial seats kicks off across the country the vihiga county gubernatorial race may have kicked off already with the aspiring candidates doing everything within their means to tarnish the image of their opponents and camps allied to the current governor moses akaranga and that of vihiga mp yusuf chanzu clashed in the open as each side struggled to discredit the other for failing to utilize resources under their watch Two camps met at Mungoma village during the official installation of the area chief Esther Lijedi. The storm was kicked off after the Chanzu camp hit at the Vihiga governor Moses Akarangas for failing to initiate meaningful development projects in the county despite immense resources allocated to his office. Akarangas camp did not take the accusation lightly. It took the intervention of the area OCS chief inspector Judith Nyongesam to restrain the two rival camps from engaging each other physically. <laughs> Before the standoff, Governor Karanga had decried the high number of cases of insecurity in Vihiga County and advised the youth to shun criminal activities. <laughs> Tuone kwamba wa mama wetu analala kwa nyumba zao kwa usalama. Na nyinyi kama kuna zile shida tuone tutashikana namna gani tu, e, tuone mambo yako e, vizuri. So vijana wacha tusi tusiwasumbue hao wa mama, tusiwasumbue hao wazee, tusiwasumbue hao vijana wetu. Tunataka tufanye kazi kama mungoma. Kama mungoma iwe nzuri sana. On the political activities, he said they had agreed with ANC party leader Msaliam Davadi to work together for the betterment of the people of Vihiga County. Meanwhile, women and youth groups in Vihiga County have received close to 6 million shillings to boost their income generating activities. Area County MP Dorcas Kedogo called on the groups to utilize the resources prudently. She also called on the government to allocate more resources for the affirmative action fund to ensure more groups benefited. Na tunawaimiza kwa sababu hiyo pesa ambayo tumepewa waweze kuchukua kwa wingi na waweze kufanya maisha yao kule nyumbani katika kutumia miradi mbalimbali ili Achola Simon reporting for Channel 1 News from Kisumu County. Thank <laughs> you.